Hello and welcome to this new video. In today's video we're going to be taking a look at the Nature Hike Snowbird 2 duck down sleeping bag. Um, I'm going to go over a few specs on it and then I'll get the sleeping bag out, show you some of the features. I've used it for over a year now and yeah, without waffling too much, let's just get straight into it. As always, got a cup of tea. Um, I've got my phone because you know what my mind's like, my mind's like a sip so it's just too much for my brain when I start trying to remember things so yeah let's just get straight into it. So the sleeping bag comes in this um, compression sack and I could probably get that. These are amazing these compression bags because you really can get this sleeping bag nice and small. Now when I get the sleeping bag out in a bit you'll see how big it is like obviously because it's down it packs down really small but lofts up like quite big so that's one of the things I love about it as I said in the intro I've used this sleeping bag for over a year now I've been in minus six in this sleeping bag and it's kept me toasty warm all night don't get me wrong that's just not that's not just the sleeping bag alone that's obviously because I was on a decent mat as well but nonetheless it kept me toasty warm it was minus six, felt like minus nine. So with a wind chill, felt like minus nine, do you know what I mean? That is cold conditions. We're gonna go over some features. So the Snowbird Mummy sleeping bag selects a 650 fill power, high quality white duck down um, with a 380 gram th filling. Obviously the one I've got is a 560 gram filling. So Obviously I can go slightly into colder conditions with it. The mummy sleeping bag fabric is soft, breathable and water repellent nylon that adapts to the multilateral nature of the outdoor climate. So it's actually pretty waterproof. Obviously I use the lantern to my feet rubbing off the side of the lantern too and I've woke up many times and the bottom of the sleeping bag's been absolutely soaked. Um, but yeah, it's not it's not got through to the duck down. If duck down gets wet, then it's pretty much ruined. Um, loses its loft and all sorts. It's got YKK, a two-way zipper. Um, and the package size, 15 centimeters by 32 centimeters length. So 15 centimeters width and 32 centimeters length. So Packs down nice and small. Um, obviously, you can get dairy sleeping bags that are pop, that pack down way smaller than this, but for the price, which we'll go over at the end, I mean, you can't go wrong, really, in my opinion. But well, when the sleeping bag's set up and on your mat in your tent, the size is 205 centimeters long and 80 centimeters wide um i'm quite like a wide guy like chubby guy and i fit in this comfortably 80 centimeters is more than enough for me um you know my big my big agnes rapid outside i think it's only 72 centimeters wide so yeah 50 uh sorry 80 centimeters is more than enough um, you know, I don't feel like trapped in it. I feel like I've got plenty of room to turn around. We're gonna take a look inside and I'll show you some of the features and let's get the sleeping bag out. So this is the sleeping bag out of the bag, lofted up. As you can see, it lofts up really, really nicely. So we're gonna go over some features. So as you can see, YKK zips, that's a dual zipper. So you've got a zip there, and then you've got a zip at the bottom as well. What well, one thing I like about this sleeping bag as well, it's a, it's like a three quarter zip, so it doesn't go all the way down to the bottom of the sleeping bag. Um, 
which I really like that little feature. So you can still like turn it into a quilt if you wanted as well. It's got a nice U-shaped comfortable hood with a drawstring cable to cinch it up so this can go nice and tight around your face. Stop them cold drops getting on you. I have to mention this little feature. It's like a U U shaped um, little cover that sits around your neck and that'll just stop any cold drafts getting down into the sleeping bag and making you cold. So when you lay down, that just sits on your neck. Um, I tend to see myself not really using this because you just sweat really badly. Like it really, really does make you warm and it really works as well. So yeah, I really, really do like that. So just a couple more things to mention. This um, bag comes in six different fillings. So you've got the 350 gram fill, the 380 gram fill, the 510 gram, the 560 gram, the 650, and the most expensive one and the biggest one, 980, which I'm pretty sure that goes down to like minus 10. Um, so obviously if you want it to go in really, really, really cold conditions. Like I said before, I've been, like, I'm not sponsored by Nature Hike. Um, obviously I'm not that, not that big on YouTube yet. I've been in really, really cold conditions in this sleeping bag. As I said, my mat obviously helped with that, but the sleeping bag does a lot of work to keep your body nice and nice and warm. Also, the I'm just going to quickly go over the comfort rating on the 650 fill power um, one what I've got. So the comfort, it says, is 2 degrees, the transition is minus 4, and the risk is minus 20. Um, and I'd say they're, they're accurate. I really would. I, I've... I mean, if you used a crap pad and this when I was in minus 9, then maybe it would have been cold, but I can't say, I'm not sure. Every time I've used this, I've always been toasty warm. Um, unless obviously I've got the wrong bed, took the wrong gear with me, etc. So yeah, um, let's go over the price. These Nature Height Snowbird 2 sleeping bags start from £119 um, for the 350 gram. Um, obviously the one I've got is £125 and the price goes up to £230 for the biggest one which is 980 gram. Um, I think definitely worth it. Um, amazing, like look at the look at the loft on that bad boy. I love it. So comfy as well, like you, you, you can just sink into it and it's just super comfy. Um, there's not much more to say really that I've, I think I've shown you everything I want to show you. Everyone should consider this bag like, I think the price is good. Um, the quality of the, of the down and it's always kept me warm. Um, and yeah, I've just had no issues whatsoever. And I'm not just saying that, I might, I might be being biased because <laughs> I do like nature height, but I'm being totally honest, it's kept me warm. Whatever I threw at it has kept me warm. Just remember what works for me might not necessarily work for you, so please consider that before buying it. So yeah, that's it from me. Thanks for watching, I really, really do appreciate it. I think I'm 18 subscribers away from a thousand subs on YouTube, which I'm super happy about, super excited. Um, since I started YouTube, as you'll know if you see my first videos, that was my goal to just get to a thousand and go from there. So super excited about that. That'll be a huge milestone for me and a big, big achievement for me personally. And yeah, if you watched the video, thanks for watching. Please consider subscribing and I'll see you in the next one. I'm going to go and take a lie down in this.